variety of 175s. But we want to put all the 175s in a different box from the minus twos. Safely and all the bags. Now say hello, sir. Hi. Hello. Say hello, Sarah. Hello. We've got 1149 specs with us now, which is more than we had last time. And so that we're hoping to do um, probably nine clinic days. We've spent this evening around a family meal talking about where we're going to go. A lot of people doing agriculture and growing their own food. Money's tight and jobs are scarce. Proper jobs, not very well paid. Everybody seems to be short of money. <laughs> what we do when we arrive at a venue for a clinic, we first have to identify the registration desk so that when people arrive, they can enter their name, their age, their occupation and whether they're literate or not, that's important that we know that. Then they go on to have their vision measured. The letter E is set in four orientations and the people have to identify whether the it's up, down, right or left because of course a lot of people can't read. And so we've trained a local chap to be able to measure the vision of the people coming in. So that by the time they see us, we have a lot of information about them. And we find that if they can read the small letters from distance, it's a fairly specific, fairly easy task to work out what reading glasses they would need. They then go to the dispensing department and Sahai, who is our host, is becoming expert at finding the right pair of glasses for people. We've written down the power on their prescription and they hand it to Sahai and she finds the right pair of glasses and fits it onto them, shows them the reading chart, enjoys the big smile. People have been pleased and it's really a good thing. I feel very happy and grateful because glasses are expensive. People are really excited. I just went out to inform people and everybody's like, this is my opportunity. <laughs> it was fun, especially when the people you put the glasses on and they, they look, oh, I can see. For the community, I had to find so many problems when looking or reading seeing, walking, but today they have found this chance from you free of charge, where they have not even wasted even a tambara or a penny. Okay, and look far away. Can you can see far away as well. So that's a mono vision. Many people who went out with the glasses, a pair or two pairs and... Uh, that's one I remember went out with three pairs. And, uh, and sometimes and so pe people who thought they did not have a problem of sight and definitely they were the most needed ones. So it was exciting to see them being helped. <laughs> okay. and now she's happy, she's sewing. She can see the needle just right. And it's quite nice to experience the African way of life and really to become a Malawian for the 10 days that we're here. I think we've developed a great system. Yeah. We've got through a lot of people mm -hmm. very quickly Definitely. and very efficiently. Yeah. Good team, good work, yeah. hey? <laughs>